Alright, well, we are heading up to the Bighorns today uh, to go catch some brook trout. And I don't know if I picked a very good day to do this. Uh, we're at pretty much peak runoff right now. The mountains also got some rain last night, so that's gonna even add it's gonna add even more to it. When you come up here to the bighorns, you always want to be on the lookout for wildlife. Got a lot of elk and a lot of moose up here. And as I was driving, I saw that guy right there. Oh, don't be too afraid, bud. Don't worry. And there, there she goes. Cow elk out feeding. What a treat, huh? Gotta love Wyoming. Got a bull moose right there. About five miles further than the than the elk we saw. Not a bad bull. Has no care in the world that we're here. Really cool. Well, let's go fishing. All right, we are at crazy woman creek in bighorn mountain range in wyoming uh, there's a lot of brook trout in here uh, the river is just it's it's really high right now um, i think that's going to make it hard to hard to catch these fish i've looked uh I've looked in this spot before when the creek is lower and shoot, you can walk up and see 50 brook trout in this one hole. Uh, but I think it's gonna be pretty, pretty difficult to get on them today. Not getting anything. Fish are definitely winning. Really? Gotta do your part. The fishing's been tough today. Um, before I'm before I leave here, I'm gonna come back up to this beaver pond real quick. Um, <laughs> so far, this is not not we're not doing very well. So. Um, We'll see here. The old beaver pond. Man, I wish there was more of these. Got a nice little brookie here. I don't know what happened with my GoPro, but I just caught like four fish and it wasn't even on. Dang it. All right. So, I don't know what I've got and what, I've do what I don't have, but uh, <sighs> I've caught about seven or eight fish. Uh, biggest one is probably 10 inches maybe. Uh, not very big, but uh, we're fishing these little, 
little creek so you're not going to catch huge ones but if you want to come out get a couple pan fryers man they're delicious uh, uh, I caught like four of them and I look at my camera whoa 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 look at my camera and it was off so I thought I was gonna have some footage but now I feel like I'm back to nothing and I don't want to be at nothing okay bring waders with you it helps this water's cold too by the way this is many many years of beavers making dams and the runoff busting them down and then they remake them that was cool seeing an elk this morning and a moose <coughs> fun little spot when you get out here I see a few few fish surfacing right now now I already caught some fish in this spot so hopefully it's not too burnt up see one over there little bit further but I don't want to cast all the way over there because if I hook into that fish I'm gonna burn up the rest of this spot there is a brookie following me on that one. Oh man had a hit there Now I'm going to cast it over there. Come on, fish. Three, two, one, bite. There's one. There's a fish. Oh, he got off. Oh, that was a little brookie. There's one. Very next cast, we got ourselves a brookie. Pretty aggressive, these guys are. Beautiful colors on them. I love these red fins. Oh, oh, see you, bud. All right, come on, fish. Three, two, one, bite. It was sleeting a minute ago. Oh, no. That was almost fatal. Start talking about it sleeting and it comes back. What the heck? Oh, there's one. There's a good fish right there. What kind do we have? Oh, man, this is a pretty, pretty brook trout right here. Look at this. No, easy bud. Just want to get a look at you. Golly, that is just beautiful. All right, see you, bud. He, that guy slammed it. Come on, fish, right here. Three, two, one, bite. And bite now. And now. And now, nothing. Right here, right here. Oh, there's one. Oh, this is a nice one. Here we go. Ooh, nice brown. 
got very nice brown right here. He came out and clobbered that thing. Bam! Oh yeah, good looking fish. There's one. All right, nice brookie. There. Right, don't worry about it, I'll, I'll put you back. Nice little fish. When doing this, you don't want to wear a red shirt because you scare the fish away. Unfortunately, that's what I brought with me. There we go. I saw him hit that. That was cool. I doubt you guys saw that. There's one. Another one I saw hit it. Another nice looking brook trout. See you, bud. I love watching them hit it. I think it's so cool. How they Got a tiny one following it. Holy cow, that guy was like three inches. Nice, a decent place to cross. Here comes a fish. He came up and hit it twice. Oh, there's one. All right. A little brown trout here. Nice fish. All right, see you, bud. Three, two, one, bite. Well, it's getting to be that time again. Oh, last cast time. Bummer. I hate last cast time. Last cast rarely ever ends with one last cast. This is this might be yeah, this is a nice one. Nice little brown right here. Thank you, sir. Or girl, I don't know. Alright, well we busted up the beaver ponds pretty good. Caught about 20, 20 small trout, rookies and browns.
Well, I'm gonna work my way back to this beaver pond over here and uh, <clears throat> cast a few more times and then get out of here. It's been about, I don't know, 20, 25 minutes since I hit this spot. <coughs> so I think a few, a few casts here might catch a fish. Whoa. Oh. If I don't blow the spot by falling in. All right, we'll see how bad I messed that up. Dang, I might have messed it up about enough to where we can't catch them. There we go. Fish on. Little brook trout. Quick release.